Now, the person who came up with the idea of this telescope was Sir Isaac Newton. Uh, and uh, Sir Isaac Newton realised that you could actually get magnification by using a mirror. Now, but the light path through this is very different. With the Galilean te telescope, we could see the light coming through the lenses, it went through one lens, it went through another lens, and then it went into the eye. With this telescope, the light path is a little different, and I can show you with smoke and lasers. So thank you. You should put the lasers on. Ah, see, smoke and mirrors. That's what it's all about. Ooh. I'm hoping that's enough smoke. And so this is what we've got. Now, at the moment, these lasers are representing the light from a distant object, so maybe a star or a galaxy that is a long, long, long way away. So the light comes in in nice parallel lines. And then what happens is that light will travel through the telescope and it will hit our reflecting mirror. And then that mirror, as we said, is designed to actually bring that light to a nice, tight focus. So it throws the light back up towards this flat mirror here. Now, this flat mirror you can buy off the shelf. This one is a shape mirror. The primary mirror is shaped, but this is just a flat mirror. And what that does is if I take the cap off and a bit more smoke, you might be able to see the laser light coming out through the top. I don't, can you see the laser light coming out of the top? So that light has travelled from a distant star, travelled through the telescope, reflected off our primary mirror, it goes up to the secondary mirror, and then it is sent out to our eye. And so that is how the way that a, a Newtonian telescope works.